Uh, again, I'm Marcus Bowers. I'm a globalpreneur. Uh, for starters, you know, a globalpreneur is somebody that does entrepreneurial things all over the globe. You know, you see a lot of people that do entrepreneur stuff where they're at. I like to do entrepreneur stuff everywhere. So I am that. Uh, I'm the type of person that go get it and then come back with it. So I travel all over the world, uh, China, Brazil, Africa, India, wherever I got to go to get the stuff that's not made here in the U.S., I come back, I create dot coms, a storefront if necessary, and then I find customers and I transact with those customers, not once, but hopefully for the rest of their lives. I, I try mm. to tell people that you want to jump into industries where you can get the customer forever and not just one time. And so uh, that's what we've been doing. You know, we started She's Happy Hair back in 2012, exactly 10 years ago, uh, wow. with just $800. And uh, we've grown way over $100 million in sales since then from that one particular brand. And again, shout out to the team. Shout out to Team She's Happy Hair. Uh, with She's Happy Hair, we've been rocking and rolling, expanding across the U.S. You know, we're the first hair company to sell hair extensions inside of Walmart. Uh, we finance hair extensions. We got a few brick and mortar locations in major cities across the U.S. And we employ so many people from our own community. Uh, and so with those same strategies that I used to grow and start She's Happy Hair, we started jumping into other industries, man. I tell people, you know, all the time, like before 2020, I only had one brand. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Your boy only had one stream of income prior to 2020. Yeah, I do comedy too, but that wasn't where the money was at. The money is in business for me, right? So when 2020 hit and Corona hit and the world shut down, it just let me know that, hey, there's a lot of opportunity out here because yeah. when the world stopped, I kept going. I never stopped. You know, the money kept coming in for us because we were already making money online. And so when Corona hit, the people that was used to going to get money couldn't go get money. But mm -hmm. the people that was already used to making money online, we just continued to make money. And so that's where uh, you see the rich getting richer and the poor getting poor. Because if you mm -hmm. wasn't making money online before 2020 and it took you between now and you know 2020 to start making money online, Amazon and she's happy here and everybody mm -hmm. we like years ahead, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. With it, you know, so um we use those same strategies to jump into uh industries like house shoes. So I got a company called Life Lacks Global, uh, where we sell house shoes to everybody around the world. Uh, when Corona hit, I started thinking about like, what's one thing that I could sell to everybody around the world? And you start thinking about what that one thing is. For me, it was house shoes because I started asking the people around me like, hey, what kind of house shoes you got at home? What kind of slippers you got at the crib? And nobody could tell me the brand name. And so that let me know that that market, that industry was wide open. Wow. And so when I look at a wide open industry, I jump in head first. And so before jumping in, I want to make sure that I could really make as much money as I wanted to and get as many customers as I wanted to. So you just remember walking outside during Corona and seeing those families walking outside together through your neighborhood or seeing people walking outside by themselves because, again, the world was shut down. So you couldn't do much but walk outside, you know. Yeah, yeah. So I saw people walking outside the neighborhood started thinking like that whole family tree wear house shoes yeah. mama daddy uncle cousin sister uh daughter brother you know what i'm saying grandpa grandma everybody wear house shoes yeah, and so yeah. if everybody wear house shoes i want to sell something that's inside of everybody's household and so when you're thinking about a product to sell to your entrepreneurs or, or to your network just think about a product that's in everybody's house go get it come back with it, create a .com, and then market to everybody because yeah. everybody needs it. And everybody needs house shoes, not one time, but for the rest of their lives. And so I jumped into uh, a company called Life Lacks Global. It's a, America's first slipper subscription service company. Uh, we sell a lot yeah, of you got a subscription for it? Yeah. Yeah, come yeah, on, yeah. man. <laughs> when, when I got on Clubhouse, again, shout out to my Clubhouse people, man. You know, a lot yeah. of people got on Clubhouse and got back off. I got on Clubhouse and stayed because that's where the information was at. Yeah, uh, yeah. There's not a lot of places where I can walk on earth and, and talk to some billionaires and millionaires and get these strategies and then implement them real time. When yeah. I got on club, I started listening to what the billionaires and the millionaires were doing. Yeah. And what all the billionaires are doing, they, they not just making money. Everybody can make money, right? Yeah. But the billionaires, they make money from you forever. Think yeah. about Apple Music. Right. We used to buy CDs. I was just talking to my homeboys about the, you know, you could tell who had money back then, you know, back in uh, the 90s or the 2000s, yeah. early 2000s, based on the amount of CDs you had in your CD case. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no <laughs> I had that big, thick CD case, right? I had to flip my CDs, you know, and yeah. so that's what I did with my bread. But nowadays you just pay $9.99 for the rest of your life to hear everything that you want to hear. But yeah. that $9.99 not going to you or the artist is going to Apple. Yeah. And then the same thing with Amazon, Amazon Prime, 
you know, you got Netflix, all these mm-hmm. subscriptions, all these billion dollar companies got memberships and subscriptions. And so I was like, I want some of that. I want to do mm-hmm. that. I don't want to just transact and make money from you individually one time or every now and then. I want that subscription. I want that for show money coming in. And so I started working on that. And that's what Life Lacks Global is. So go follow Life Lacks Global on social media and buy some shoes. Plus, yeah. Black Lives Matter, right? If Black Lives yeah. Matter, show me. If you, on, if you, hey, show me. And you got somebody else house shoes in your house, come holler at your boy. You know what I'm saying? Your come boy. Yeah. Tell your people, come get some house shoes too, right? Or 